If you are a complete beginner and you want to learn how you can be able to buy Bitcoin, this is a video that I will actually go through step by step on the two ways that you can actually be able to buy Bitcoin using P2P. If you don't have a Binance account, check the first link in the description below in order to download the app and sign up, get verification as well. Let's get those credits rolling. So if you want to buy Bitcoin, what we'll actually do is click on the Binance app once we are on the app itself it usually brings us to the home page what you'll do at the bottom right you will see wallets click on it and once you click on wallets it will actually show you the total amount of money you have invested into crypto at the moment you will see at the very top overview spot funding margin futures earn and pull for today we are just going to do it really simply and then i'll show you a little secret when we get to the end so what we are actually going to do right now is click on funding once you click on funding this is where you can actually start buying bitcoin immediately you will see it shows you deposit withdraw transfer p2p pay gift card and pool so what we'll do right now is click on p2p when you click on p2p it will actually show you the different people who are selling the different cryptocurrencies we are currently interested in bitcoin which is written btc so we click on it at the very top you'll see p2p that's the first method how p2p works is different people have set how much they are selling and at what amount they are selling it at so at the very top right now i can see someone who's selling it at 4.383 and they're selling 500 shillings to 29,000. then the next person after that is a little more expensive by about 7,000 bob but they're selling from 270 to 566 so if we we're buying 500 and above then would buy from this person who's selling at 29,000. the second person is selling about 500 shillings so what we'll actually do is click on the second one and click on buy when you come here you will be able to see buy fiat or buy crypto so at this particular moment i want to buy from this person a small amount which is about 300 shillings then what will happen next is you can actually be able to see how many minutes you have in order to make this happen so i'll click on the amount that i want to buy and click on buy with zero fee so what will happen next is it will take me to the screen where i can actually be able to make this purchase so there are two different payment methods that he has given which is m-pesa and m-pesa pay bill and then there are terms as well and he says if he delays by more than five minutes to call him on that particular number so what i'll do is click on to payment page and i can either send to m-pesa or i can send to pay bill the goodness with sending to pay bill is it's completely free and that's the option that i usually choose so that's what i'll actually choose in this case so i'll click on pay bill now at the top it will tell you the order will be cancelled in 14 minutes so i have 14 minutes to make this particular transfer so what i actually do here there is the account number and there is a pay bill number this is very simple i just click on the account number I keep the pay bill number in my mind and then i have to go now and make this payment straight so what i do is just go onto my payment app that's complete so the next thing that i actually do right now is i prefer to actually send a confirmation message to the person because i 
usually don't want any issues and someone says they have not seen the money yet all those things so what i just do i go to my mpesa message i pick the mpesa message copy it come back to binance click on chat this is just best practice from what i do and then i'll actually input it here and once i have done that i go back away from the chat and then i click on transferred notify seller so that's the first way that you can actually be able to buy crypto this is through the p2p method so as that is happening what i'm actually waiting for now is for the person on the other end to release they'll just confirm from their bank account that they've received my money so i want to now show you the second way that you can actually be able to buy crypto so at the top where it says p2p you'll actually click on it and it says select trading zone p2p and express so i'll click on express and here we want to buy but we want to buy bitcoin so here i'll say i want to buy above what amount so here i'll say i want to buy above this can be any amount a hundred thousand or thirty thousand let's actually put thirty thousand so that you can actually be able to see this it shows you now the best offer for this whether it is on m-pesa or on paybill for thirty thousand it actually allows you to do from 500 shillings going up so i'll click on buy with zero fee so what this does for us is it shows us who is the best offer at this particular time if you don't want to go through the whole list of p2p express makes it very easy for you to be able to get the best offer make the payment and you're done with it so that's what we'll actually do we'll click on confirm purchase and once you've clicked on confirm purchase it will actually show you the payment method and the terms of this person and it says no third party payments in case of payment issues call me at this number so we'll click on the next and it tells us the number of that particular person so we'll click on this copy sign and then it says copy successful we go back to our mpesa app and we now send this person money directly after we have done this we go back pick that message that we have just sent and then i'll come here paste it here just for the confirmation for this person to be able to see click on send then i go back out of the chat click on transfer notify seller so once that is done that person will actually release so what we will actually go to do is on the first one that we had it has already been completed once it has been completed at the bottom here you'll see how was your trading experience with this particular person because they did this transaction very quickly i'll just come here and say positive i'll even leave a comment and say this trader was fast in releasing so you can either do an anonymous comment or the comment will show your name so if you want to see that i'll actually just click on the profile and you can actually be able to see the comment that i have just made about this person they have gotten 119 feedback from people and it's good to give feedback because this helps other people who are trying to buy as well so here we come and this one is pending at the moment and that's simply how you can be able to buy so once you have bought this amount will now show under your funding wallet this is your p2p wallet this is the first wallet that you have on binance but in order for you to have it on your spot wallet which is your main wallet what you'll come and do at the top here is click on transfer and then it will ask you to transfer from either funding to spot wallet or the other way around and at this time we want to transfer from the funding or p2p wallet and transfer it to the spot wallet all i'll just do here is click on max and then click on confirm transfer once i click on confirm transfer it will actually send that amount 
to my spot wallet at the moment while i'm recording this the second one has already been released and i'll go and do a review on their trade as well because they are doing it really fast this is actually without any cut at all while i'm recording this so i'll transfer this amount as well to my spot wallet and my funding wallet remains with no money at the moment so that's what i usually prefer that after i have done my trade on p2p i actually transfer it to the spot wallet so here we are on our spot wallet you can actually be able to see our btc is here the full amount that we have just bought and that is a simple way on how you can be able to buy bitcoin on p2p i'll see you in the next one